For the past seven days, I've been using an AI personal assistant to manage my entire life. The tool is called Voice Notes AI, and how it works is you record voice notes, it transcribes them, titles them, and saves them. Then you can ask your AI questions about all of your voice notes, whether that be to make a to-do list for you for the week, give you your priorities for the day, ask what to get your friend for his birthday, or anything else. You basically just record all your stray thoughts, ideas, to-dos, and learnings, then you can query them using your AI. What should I do in my evenings after a long day of work if I want to unwind and relax? I like to think of it as a personal assistant with perfect memory that's with me all the time. If I ever have an idea, I just tell my assistant, hey, this is an idea I have that I want to do at some point, then the assistant records it. Then I can ask the assistant questions about anything that I want, whether it be related to the notes I have or not, and it can give me responses tailored to me based on what it knows about me from the notes I have recorded. I've been using the AI to assist with knowledge retention by transcribing the notes I have from books, I've been telling it all my ideas, and I've been giving it my to-do lists. I also gave the AI lots of details about me, like my long-term goals, my vision for my life, my current job, where I live, and more, because I wanted more tailored answers to me personally, my values, and my long-term goals. Here's exactly how I've been using it to manage my life. When I wake up every day, the first thing I usually do is plan my day. In the past, I've been looking at my calendar, my active projects, and my texts to make a rough plan for the day in my pocket notebook, which I made a video about here if you want to check that out. Now with the AI personal assistant, when I wake up, I take out my phone and I ask, what are my top priorities for the week and what should I do today to help me push towards those goals? And it spits out a plan for me for the entire day. I can even ask it, do my weekly goals and daily to-dos align with my long-term goals and vision I have for the future? It helps to keep me aligned, keep me on track, and literally never forget anything. And as part of the planning for the day, it will factor in all the knowledge I have saved in it. So, like a takeaway from a book. For example, I was rereading The 4-Hour Workweek by Tim Ferriss when I started using this AI. And instead of writing down my notes in a notebook like I usually do, I decided to just take out my phone and press record whenever I had something that I wanted to save. One of these notes was on the use of Pareto's Principle, aka 80% of results coming from 20% of the effort, and Parkinson's Law, aka things expand to the time set aside for them, so always set quick deadlines for yourself. Use together to optimize your work and the amount of time you waste. Now, when I ask for my daily to-dos, it takes that note into account when making the plan. It will say, make sure to set aside shorter time slots for the tasks according to Parkinson's law and only focus on the important tasks according to Pareto's principle. In the past, I would use Notion to capture everything. Then at the end of the week, I would go back and sort through all the captures I made for the week and put them where they belong. Now, I literally don't need to do anything but take out my phone and press record to capture a stray thought. It will never be forgotten or unused again. This tool can essentially replace a second brain. It's nuts. So I'm gonna keep trying it out. There's also other features like being able to turn a particular note into a to-do list or blog post or tweet or an email, but I haven't really used these much because I've only had the tool for a week, but I do plan on using them in the future and they all seem very useful. So yeah, that's what my experience has been like for the past week using this personal assistant AI. I'm absolutely going to continue to use it and you should give it a shot too. It's completely free to try and then there's a premium version you can buy if you really like it. That's it though, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell and like the video if you enjoyed. You can watch another video right here. Alright, peace.